Hey guys, it's Senya, and today I'm going to be telling you guys how to study for your junior cert mocks. And you can use this for your actual junior cert. But I actually haven't done my mocks yet, I'm doing them in three weeks. Christmas exam last month, and I actually did pretty good in them. So I'm just going to be telling you guys how I study and how I'm going to study for my mocks. In my previous video, it actually got like half a thousand views, and um, I got some nice comments about people telling me to do more kind of study videos and tips. So, um, somebody asked me how did I study for Of Mice and Men, but I didn't want to make a whole video about that because I don't really think that's a lot to say. So basically how I'm going to study for Of Mice and Men is go on Spark Notes and look at all the key scenes and write summaries about all the key moments. So if they ask, and I'm going to do little like... I'm gonna like write all the characters names and do little bullet points about them about their like personality and stuff so if a question comes up then i know what to say or if a question asks about a key moment or something like that then i know what to do because i honestly don't know what kind of questions will be on about of mice and men so i'm sorry but that's how i'm going to study for it is going to make little summary sheets for each of the key moments so yeah don't even mind my hair i don't even know what's going on no makeup i think the comments and I knew I wouldn't have time to film unless I film it now because I actually have Spanish oral mocks on Monday that I have to study for. So that's great. But I'm set on my mocks. I know exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to do good on my mocks. Okay. Anyway, so I'm going to just tell you guys how to study. Okay, so if you guys didn't know, this is my favorite way to study is using these little study books. I have a lot. So I actually, I actually bought a few of them and I got some in the library. So yeah. So, I have a history one, geography, business studies, Irish, science, maths, the other maths paper, oh, the other maths paper, and home economics. So, a tip to you is to use these study books. I'm telling you, they're so much better than the textbooks. Like, I can't study from a textbook at all. Like, I can't. Like, okay. These are all the short and down for you already. Like, I really, really, really like these. It brings me on to my next point. So, for my exams, I use flashcards or I make study sheets. I don't really like using flashcards anymore. I like to use them in first and second year. Because in third year, I feel like it's like a big stacks like this. And it makes it, like, very overwhelming. Like, I don't really like to use them anymore but they're here if i need them they're here if i need them like i'm a visual learner so these are all for my november exam i think this is for geography this is for geography so basically what i would do is write it and then i write little bullet points about it and summarize it for myself like i'd use the study books to even summarize it for myself so it's nice and easy so i was trying out this new thing today and i got a copy book this is going to be used for history so what i'm going to do is i'm going to this is a lot of writing but i'm a visual learner so when i'm going to be writing it down i'm going to be learning the information so for like your mocks it's everything from first to third year so i have my study books because i don't have all of my hardbacks from first to third year so i use my study books i summarize everything so these are all the key terms from first year i'm not done yet and then i have page numbers written on it and in my index, I'd write from example page one to five key terms, page two to seven Mesolithic periods, page three to four like Roman times, like stuff like that. That's going to be like really easy for me to learn. So that's my favorite way to study is to write and learn, because like I don't know, I just I can't read and learn like that won't stay in my head. If you can't tell, I really like this brand of study book, Less Stress, More Success. I like it because it has exam questions in it, so. I don't need to use my exam papers, but like the shortcut, to the shortcut to success is really good as well, but it doesn't have like all the information. And sometimes my book has more information than that, but I know it's meant to be summarized, but it doesn't like have questions in it. So I still like it. I still use it. Like this is my favorite thing to use, but yeah. So my next tip to you guys is use your exam papers. God, I sound stupid. I know you're supposed to use your exam what? papers. I mean like use your exam papers outside school in your own time. So you get used to the questions. That's an example I have here in my math exam papers. Um, I don't really like using my exam papers. Like, I'm not gonna lie, I don't like them, but I still do it because I know it's for my own good. And the little sh um, less stress, more success books. Let me find them. The end of each like little chapter, you have to have exam questions. 
So I think you guys should get this. You can get it in the library. You don't even need to buy it. Get it in the library. Use it. It's really, really good. So what I like to do as well is I make all of my little notes, study sheets, study book, whatever. I make them ages before my exam. So I don't have to stress before my exams. Like my mock start on the first of Feb the fourth of February. And I'm starting start of um January. Even I started in December because I don't want to be rushed because it's a lot of information that you're meant to know so you start before and sometimes for stuff i don't know i will use flashcards but just not big in for big like big stacks because um in my summer exam i had big stacks and it made me really 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 stressed out and yeah this is a study book that i made for science yeah science for my november exams and i actually got 81 in science so i think that's really good because i'm i summarized everything for myself from first to third year Like, I have everything that I needed to know here. So, yeah. Okay, if you guys have any any questions about studying, leave them down below. Because I will... If you guys need a specific help with a subject... The only subjects that I really can't help you with are Irish and maths. Like, they're not my strong suits. I have to try myself really, really hard. But if it's, like, geography, history, science, I can help you. So, if you guys need um help down below, just comment and I can help you guys. So yeah, that's basically how I study. I am a visual learner. I write little study sheets. I write books. I do flashcards. But I wouldn't recommend flashcards if you get stressed out by big stacks. It's really good to test yourself. That's when I would use flashcards. Or you can get someone to help you. Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and it was somehow helpful to you guys. So, bye.